Well, here at the C terminal, slightly unusual vending machine. It's all gone pink, obviously to do with the breakthrough breast cancer appeal. And uh, whose idea, first of all? Well, it was my idea. Sadly, um, last year, my 40-year-old cousin died of breast cancer, leaving a husband and two young children. And it really brought home to me how close this disease is to all of us. And I just came up with the idea, utilising the facilities I have with vending on the Isle of Man and a very loyal customer base who have agreed to site the machine for me. And I'm very pleased and proud that this is the first of its kind in the British Isles. And it's created a lot of interest from the vending industry. And Cadbury's, first of all, has donated a lot of the stock that's in the machine. And all the profits will be going to Breakthrough Breast Cancer. Fantastic. You must be very pleased with this idea. Oh, I'm so pleased. Thank you so much, Tracy, for doing this for us. Absolutely phenomenal idea. And I'm sure it'll be very successful. I think when you hear the statistics that one in eight women are going to be affected by breast cancer in their lifetime, that to me is very scary. And that's why I wanted to get involved with Breakthrough Breast Cancer. I was diagnosed 16 years ago. Um, I've come through it. Absolutely brilliant. And I just want to give something back. So there's so much fundraising that goes on in the Alabama for Breakthrough. And this is quite a unique um, opportunity as well like I say no one's done it before so that's brilliant so thank you again Tracy fantastic a bit of a double whammy because you had me in a bra <laughs> one of the most viewed videos yeah. by the most viewed videos <laughs> online last week but that was, that was another great successful event wasn't it very successful we haven't we're still totting up all the money but we're hoping that we will raise uh, equal to last year's um, total to date was 123,000 so in a few weeks we should have a grand total so yeah, it's very, very successful. So back to the vending machine, how long is it going to be here and, and you know, do you know how much money it might make for the charity? Well, it's going to be here at the sea terminal until just after TT week. So on the 11th of June, it's going to be moving um, to a new site, which will be letting everybody know on our Facebook site where that is. Um, we're asking anyone who has a workplace of over 100 staff or who's in charge of a public site with lots of footfall to let us know um, if they'd be interested in having this machine on, on their site. Thank you